Hey what's up mga kakirig, uh, welcome to my channel mga kakirig no? So for today's video mga kakirig is I will show you the diagram for this uh, 3 pumps uh, with alternate operation with full auto divert so with advanced advanced na ito mga kakirig na motor control mga kakirig no? So uh, last video, if you watch that my last video mga kakirig so ang pinakita ko lang na simulation, simulation is itong uh, ganito mga kakirig no? So ayan, alternate sila. So ito yung uh, Silby. Uh, this one is uh, float switch. So I will try to speak English a little bit mga kakiring no? because uh, uh, there are some other countries that watching uh, already watching my videos mga kakiring and they uh, uh, want they want to speak me English. So I'm not good in speak, in speaking English mga kakiring no. So I will try my best. So please uh, appreciate my wrong grammar English mga kakiring no. So, <laughs> so I will try my best plan, mga kirik. So, uh, here we go. So, the video, last video, mga kirik, about three pumps with alternate operation, uh, advanced auto divert trip. So, on, only I show is the simul the simulation for this operation because I hide the main control circuit. So, this is the main control circuit. Circuit you you cannot uh, see it clearly because it's too small and far and it's too complicated no so for now i will i will show it to you uh, step by step so first of all i will uh, demo again the uh, operation for this so this is the float switch uh, this is the float switch mga kirig so these are the three motors no three phase motors natin so uh, they will run alternately every time the um uh, uh, float switch or any sensors that triggers the three motors no so just like that when open pump one is, is off when uh, when close pump two is energized open de energize or stop so oh, I forgot to uh, on the breaker for pump three so oh, so just like that we, uh, I push I press accidentally press the uh, overload so automatically the pump one is uh, run no, auto back up so as you can see in the indicator light the uh, pump three trip indicator light is uh, blinking so if reset so just like that so if pump one is uh, trip pump two is automatic back up run no so if the pump one is not still uh, reset or still in failure mode so the pump two and pump three will be the one to alternate operation no just like that so pump 3 pump pump 2 just like that so if the pump 1 is in back in normal so you can join the uh, normal operations mga kakirig so just like that if uh, the pump 2 again is the has a failure or trip so uh, only pump 1 and pump 3 will be alternating just like that no if the pump 2 is okay so you can run so if the pump 3 is uh, going to trip just like that so pump 2 and pump pump 1 pump 2 will on alternating uh, operation just like that so uh, i just uh, this uh, this kind of situation if only one trip uh, the diagram for this is too easy no or not so uh, not so difficult so if the scenario is like this two motors will trip just like pump 1 no and then the backup pump 2 is a uh, trip also so the our control circuit will be uh, uh, will be a little bit difficult mga kirig, no? so if pump 3 is the only available so he will be the one to on and off automatically no? to operate no? so if they just like pump 2 and pump 3 also so pump 1 will also be the one will uh, uh, operate operating mga kirig. so Sorry for my English mga kirig, I'm not good in English, so I'm just trying. So just like that. So if pump 1 and pump 3 is uh, a trip, so just like that mga kirig. So only pump 2 mga kirig will energize. So for now, I will show you the uh, diagram, but because of um, you cannot cl see it clearly because it's it's too small, the chuggings are small. So I will try to... Uh, don't skip my videos mga kirig because uh, I will... I will um, make it visible for you so stay put mga kirig so 
for now mga, mga Kerik, I will show you uh, step by step mga Kerik. So I want to uh, supposed to be I want to explain it expl explain it uh, <laughs> step by step but uh, the uh, control circuit for this is so difficult to um, uh, explain mga Kerik no kasi marami nang so many na uh, so marami na yung uh, interlockings nito. So uh, what I mean is uh, the interlockings are so crazy. So that's why <laughs> that's that's why uh, for automation mga kirig uh, conventional is uh, so it's not uh, it's not um, this is not applicable for conventional mga kirig, no so mostly uh, it will be done by uh, programming just like uh, smart release or PLCs mga kirig, because if we do it in um, uh, in conventional mode so we will use so many relays no so unless unlike sa programming mga kirig uh, you can use unlimited uh, auxiliaries no but uh, on th this video mga kirig i will still show you if you want to learn in conventional na diagram po nito i mean if gusto niyo makita yung uh, diagram nito sa conventional so i will show it to you mga kirig no This is it mga Kirio. This is the final uh, setup no? for the diagram. So uh, you can screenshot it here. So you can 
so that you can copy this one mga kirig, no? so you can screenshot that one so reminder mga kirig uh, uh, this uh, control circuit is not still not yet still perfect mga kirig no? because I made it in uh, just uh, I made it in rush mga kirig just to uh, demo just to uh, show you the demonstration no? so you can uh, revise it mga kirig so to make it perfect so but uh, it's up to you no so if you will make it to conventional uh, actual in, actual installation so you can maybe you can use um, uh, up to 14 release mga kirig no but at in programming no like PLC or or smart relay so you can use here unlimited unlimited na uh, because in programming, uh, in programming mga kirig like PLC or Smart Relay, so up to 9 relays only mga kirig. No? Because in programming, uh, you can use unlimited na uh, auxiliary contacts. Uh, while sa um, conventional is uh, limited lang kasi mga kirig. No? So, ang yung mga relay natin is nasa uh, uh, 4 sets lang yun. No? So, bali, 4 na in O, 4 na in C. So, so kung sa altern uh, sa conventional is siguro gagamit kayo ng 13 to uh, 9 uh, 13 to 15 na na auxiliary uh, na uh, relay mga kirig pero sa programming like PLC so maybe mataas na yung 9 na um, relay no so it's up to you mga kirig no so kung kayo na yung uh, magredesign nito mga kirig no so bali ganito so it it, it test natin so pakita ko sa inyo so this is the float switch so kayo na bahala mag-modify no so yun natin yung mga breakers so just like that no so trip no trip okay trip so if okay 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 so please don't forget to like share and subscribe mga kirig no so you can save it now thank you